Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my island biscuit. This is my grandma crawl island. Well, it was. I kind of had a moment. So I will be honest here. I tried to build an x build and I tried to change my entrance a little bit because I wasn't happy with it and I didn't like it. I didn't like it, so I ended up just knocking the whole thing down. So here we are, rebuilding the entrance today. Let's get to it. Like, we have the road going across here. It was, it was fun, you know? It was, it was fine. It was okay. I just... I just didn't like how everything just fell. I don't know. I was trying to explain and trying to build in the last video I was trying to do. So the one that's unreleased because I've deleted it now. <laughs> because I knocked it all down. And I was trying to figure out how I wanted this to look. And it was just not... I was not feeling it. So we're going to change it up, I think. I don't know how. I don't know how, what, what we're doing. I don't know. We're going to just try my best to do whatever. I still am doing grandma core, by the way. I'm still doing grandma core and cats. I'm still definitely doing that because that's what I wanted to do. I just need to go about it a different way. Because I've done so many entrances for islands, I think I'm just stuck. I'm like, what do I do? What do I do for an entrance now if I've done so many? How do I change it up? I think we're going to do a little pond here. Well, I don't think I want it to go right down though. I think I want to leave a bit of a gap so you can walk through. I also want to have this island completely flat. Apart from water terraforming, I don't want to do any other terraforming. This tree is definitely in the way. But right, let's get rid of this tree first. All right, yeah, let's get rid of this tree. Oh, there's a bush there. Oh, look, I've left the bushes. So I've tried to clear as much as possible. So yeah, in the video that never happened, I, I had done the resident services. I did a little bit in front of there. And I also changed the, well, I changed some of the entrance. And I just, I don't know what it was. I think the bridge, I think the bridge was putting me off. I don't know why. I just, I don't know. But there's a cute little pond. And then maybe we could do some sort of like water terraforming across here. Maybe we can make a cute little river, right? I love an angled bridge. Why not do an angled bridge, right? I'm just going to try and keep to what I love, keep to what I know, but obviously change it up because it's a different item. I'm not going to do everything identical. I just feel like I should stick with the things that I really enjoy doing. So I really enjoy angled bridge. Oh, apparently we can't stick it there. These trees are in the way too. Right, so there's where our angled bridge is going to go. So we just need to fill out the area. Well, not fill it out. Get rid of it. Fill it with water. We need to fill this like this. And then I think it'd be kind of cute, you know, a little whimsical bridge. I still want to use the road. Oh no, why did I fill it in? I still want to use the road code that we have. I just, I don't want it at the front. I feel like I do that all the time. And I just was kind of not feeling the road being right there. Also, we did that on Hoppington recently. And I felt like the entrance was very similar. I think I even said it was similar. And so I don't want to do that again. No, I want to change it. And I want to just do something very cutesy, very whimsical. Like I said, we're still going to have the cats. We still do. I actually moved in a new cat. She's super cute. She's adorable. You're all going to love her. I'd never had her before, I don't think. Anyway, let's sort this river out. So you'll come in. There'll be like this cute area. Oh, we could do a little house here. <gasps> yes. Yes, yes, yes. Actually, to be honest, we probably could keep this road. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. We might keep the road. We might keep the road there. I could do a little house here still. It would be really cute. So yeah, a little angle bridge and then a house. Right, let me go and move these bushes and I'm going to grab our bridge. Oh, look, there's Tangy. There's sweet Tangy. She's not staying. I know she's a cat, but she's not staying. She's the wrong color scheme, unfortunately, but I love her. She's so cute. She'll be on another island in the future. I know it. Okay, so let's get our bridge built. Also, I couldn't grab the bells because look at my storage. I was like, wait, why can't I grab the bells? And then realize it's because I'm full of stuff. Oh no, that's definitely not where I wanted it. What was that? There we go. That's where we want it. This is the spot. All right, we'll pay Lloyd off in a minute because I, I couldn't get the bells in my back. I might even have to go put all this stuff down somewhere. Oh my gosh, we're literally so full. Also, I grabbed my house. Yes, I grabbed my house because I was thinking I could put my house here. How cute would that be? I'm actually kind of thinking to myself now. I'm thinking maybe the road was the issue. Not the road code, okay? Because the road code is absolutely stunning. By the way, it is created by Crystal Cat, if any of you want to know. Crystal Cat has a Twitter, so please do go and check them out. But Crystal Cat makes so many amazing codes. And that was one of the road codes that they made. I think that's what's 
causing me the issue is I'm trying my hardest to fit the road code in. Like, I have ideas of what I could do, but the road code just kind of doesn't fit those ideas. So I might get rid of the road code. Yes, I think I'm not going to use the road code. It's a very cute one. Like I said, made by Crystal Cat. So if you want it, it will be there. I think that's where the issue is lying. Oh my gosh, I think we found the problem. We have found the problem in my head. It was just really kind of sad because I was getting a bit like, oh, I do not know what I want to do. I feel like I've done everything. And I think that's what it is because I've used the road code so often. I'm done with using the road code for now. But I think I want to bring this all the way around. Oh, this is going to look like another island I've already done, right? Wait, does this look like an island I've already done? I think so. It's okay. We just, we're going with it. Okay, so we've got kind of this sort of shape going on. I want to whack my house in here. Uh, where is it? There it is. There's my house. Oh, that's a bit too close to the river. Let me pull it back just to like maybe here. My house, by the way, is not customized okay, so there's my house it is not done like i said i haven't done the exterior of it yet so it's not gonna look nice when we time travel and move it in but you know what can you do wait can you jump over from here to here oh yes that's so cute i like that i like it i like it but yeah i think the issue is just lying with the fact that i don't think i can make this work not today I think I'm just not feeling road code for this island, which is fine. It's absolutely fine. Well, we'll just replace it with a different code. I have one in mind, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So I'm going to have to do a little bit of time traveling quickly just to get these things done. Oh, wait, I need to pay Lloyd off and then I'll time travel and I'll be right back. Okay, so we time traveled. There's the house. We will need to customize this by the end of the video because that's not, that's not going to stay like that. I just... I, I'm already happy with this. Also, I did get another code. So this has replaced the road code. I know a lot of you love the road code. Like I said, Crystal Cat did it. I will post the code in the description, but I won't be using it on this island. I'll use it on a different island. But I got this cute one instead. Now, what we want to do is work on this area around my house. So, well, let's get to it. Oh, oh, I want a little jumping section here. So first, actually, we should start on... Let's get a helmet. Okay, so first thing we want to do is start with a little bit of a pathway over here. Like I was saying, I feel like I still want to do a completely flat island. I think it would just be nice to do, you know, there's no stress of terraforming too much and having to get terraforming done for a certain build and things. So I think it would just be nice to just have no no terraforming just flatten everything it'll be a nice little difference i don't want to bring this by the way all the way over to my house and i also don't think i want to bring it to the entrance i just want to do a little bit of a something something here because we love a something something also yes boone is still here we can see him in the background he's okay like he's not offensive you don't look at him and hate him well i don't i don't look at him and hate him i feel like i could have ended up with worse there are definitely worse gorillas so, you know, before when I was like, oh yeah, this island is going to channel this island that I've done, this island that I've done. It's not. <laughs> I think this is gonna be more like Daisy Chain than anything, which is not a bad thing because Daisy Chain was cute. I had so much fun building Daisy Chain. So the fact that we're doing a grandma core version of Daisy Chain is kind of exciting. I would have loved to of you know carried on the primrose vibes, but it's just I just can't. I'm not feeling the road code for this island i'm just not by the way i could have easily probably just left the entrance but i wouldn't have liked it and i didn't want to just pretend to everybody that i i liked it when i didn't it wasn't horrible there was nothing wrong with the entrance so if you've ever built an entrance like that on your island it's cute i wasn't feeling it for this island today you know not today but in general right so we're gonna bring these across i don't know why i did it straight across in a line but don't worry I hope this all makes sense by the time we, we finish. I want these to look like little tracks. So we will be splitting them up. I will be adding, you know, extra bits in between. I think if we just go to there for now, that'll be okay. Let's do the little end pieces. Also, Punchy's there. Oh, he's so cute. I love Punchy. Okay, everyone who didn't tell me their favorite cat in the last video, tell me your favorite cat, villager. Go. <laughs> Who's your favorite? Okay, I think that works. Let's just get rid of some of this so that I don't confuse my brain and my brain goes, no, you don't like it again. <laughs> now, what we want to do is start putting our greenery in. So we want to start putting flowers and bushes and trees in. Oh, and also some fencing. I'm going to grab some vertical board fence. Oh, look at Punchy. He's just checking himself out in the mirror. Punchy, you're a 10 out of 10. 
You don't need to check yourself out. Everyone here could probably tell you you're a cutie pie. Anyway, let's see. I want to leave this as a gap because I want you to be able to jump over there just because it's cute. All right, we're going for cutesy grandma. This is definitely going to be a different vibe, but I'm cool with that. I'm happy with that. It's going to be a little bit more cluttered. Also, another reason why I'm probably feeling a little bit off about the first one we did is because I know I'm going to be doing a normcore island next. And I know I'm probably not going to clutter that up as much as normal. I'm actually excited to to do it i'm excited because i'll be using no codes for that one so be kind of like a challenge you know kind of and so i'm very excited for that i need to stick a tree in here so maybe we won't use this okay change plan for this one anyway as i was saying i feel like i don't want to be doing two minimalistic islands at the same time because even though that wasn't classified as a minimalistic entrance build i feel like it was feeling that way and that probably didn't help as well anyway enough about the original entrance we are on about now now and what is present <laughs> this is what we're doing i'm gonna love this new style i know it i can feel it already i'm like like, yes, I'm so happy with this already. Right, so I need to stick a tree in here because I need trees. Why no trees? Is it because of my house? It was because of my house. We have no flowers on us, so I'm gonna have to get some flowers. I am, however, gonna put that cute little code back down. You know the one we did with the heart? See this little heart code, how cute. And then we're gonna put the same items on there because I absolutely adored those. But first I need to, ooh, where do I wanna put a bush? I think, Oh, do I want a tree or a bush? Probably a bush because I don't want this to be blocked. Stone fencing is coming back out, it is. Put this across here. Oh my gosh, look at Chevra over there. She's just snoozing, she's so cute. I can't with her, she's adorable. Right, sticking this across here. Do I like it double laid? Ooh. Yes, I've never used these double laid before. I think I'm only gonna do it there. Yeah, I think so. Right, I'm gonna grab some flowers. Yeah, I'm definitely already 100% happy with this island. It looks so cute. I have some advice, I guess, a little bit of advice. If you feel like you are struggling with your theme, definitely try and figure out if it's a code or something that you're trying to use but you can't get to work or it might be something else just you'll figure it out you will you'll get there because this is what happened to me <laughs> okay i'm gonna have to pick this piece up to put this piece down which is kind of annoying but what can you do also yes i changed my mind i said i wasn't going to put this here and i changed my mind actually actually no put it back <laughs> I was hesitating again. Oh, I kind of like this gap because you know what would look cute in this gap? A bush. I think before I get carried away, I do need to grab some weeds and some items. Otherwise, we'll just have bushes and flowers. So I wanted to grab these free items before I forgot what they were. I believe we had the pet bed here. I know I could go back and look at my video, but that's effort. <laughs> oh no, I had the cushion there, I remember. So we had the pet bed here and then the cushion went here like so also i customized the pet bed how cute right and then we had the little the little tea set let's add some flowers because everybody loves flowers excuse me chevra i don't mean to push you but i really want to stick a flower here a little lily of the valley oh it looks so cute and precious oh my gosh i feel so much happier with this island already like i said it's not that i didn't like it i just need it to feel different Okay, so quickly over by my house, we need to customize this house because it is not staying like this. It looks so weird. I think what we should do is stick a doily because what is more grandma call than a doily if I can find the doily? Ah, oh, there it is. Oh no, I can't do the doily because it's too wide. Oh, that bugs me. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. We could try something else, right? I could try maybe this and then stick the doily round it. Oh gosh, no. Oh gosh. No, 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 no. That did not come out how I wanted it. Okay, next plan. Why not use our new code? There we go. Then once we stick a leaf pile on there or near here, I think it would look really nice. So I will be going along and putting weeds, by the way, in these some of these gaps. For now, I think that looks really cute. As it is, I like the little the little path. Or would it look better as wood planks? I'm going to change it. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so indecisive. I'm going to let you know from the top of now that I'm indecisive today. Oh my gosh, Punchy made my day. Oh, he's such a sweet little bean. Look at him saddle that cushion. He has no right to be that. Oh, he got off. 
I was gonna say something nice about him, but he got off. Let's stick a little bit of a bush in here. I say a little bit, it's it's a bush. Like it's a full blown bush. I think I'm also gonna do some more fencing. Oh, would the vertical board fence look nice? I'm gonna try. If it blocks too much, it is gone. But if we maybe stick it here and then do like a little gap there so that you can get to the beach. This could work. This could be precious. I kind of like it. I think once we start to decorate it a little bit more, it will be much better. Right, let's add some flowers in. Oh, from here to here, I'm going to use the little wood coat because why not? Look, I adore this thing. There's definitely going to be a lot more flowers involved in this, this version of the island. Yes, a lot more flowers, which is not a bad thing. I don't think it's a bad thing. I think this is coming out really cute. It feels more grandma core than what the last one did, in my opinion. Obviously, if you preferred the last one, that's fine. That is 100% your choice, but for me, I really like this. I forgot I had a puddle code. Oh my gosh, I always have a puddle code. For here, I was thinking we could stick wherever it is. For here, I was thinking we could add a cat tower. All right, cute little cat tower. And then also in this gap, I was thinking to myself, you know, what could we stick here that was cat related? Hello Kitty Planter. I know it's got a red bow, but it works. We know red and pink works, don't we? We know it does because we've done it on a, a whole island. And then a little scooter. Oh, actually change of plan. I think I'm going to leave the planter, but I think I'm going to change that with a garden wagon. Oh yes. And then move this bike up. Maybe we could put the bike here. Oh, it's going the wrong way. I, I don't know why, but I want it to go the other way. I feel like bike placement is important sometimes. There we go. Oh, I realized this bit isn't finished. I didn't put the end piece on. I just left it. There we go. Along here, I don't know if I'm going to like these as much, but I've got some flower beds. I just thought, you know, they're very cute. Very whimsical. They might give us more of a grandma feel, although that one's around the wrong way. There we go. Pop it in very cute and then on the floor here i'm gonna add a doily it says cute little doily here and then i'm going to add a street lamp oh, although i don't know if i'm gonna like it this side i think i might want it the other side yes yeah, because that blocks the house too much so maybe we'll stick a bush or something there instead put the doily the other side and then put the street lamp there because I, it won't block the house as much okay Oh, wait, do I have to shimmy? I don't want to shimmy to get through. That is kind of cute. All right, I need some weeds. Once again, I'm going to try not to use wheat field. <laughs> I don't know why. i just telling myself not to do it. All right, these weeds should grow in really nicely. And if not, I'll be repicking them again. Oh, cat tower. Cat tower, yes. And then maybe another cat tower. Because, you know, I don't want to overdo it. That's too much. <laughs> That is too much. Maybe we could do something cute in front, though. Maybe see, I'll see what I got. I see. I see. I may have grabbed a lot of stuff, but that's fine because we're probably going to use it all. I need more flowers, but not yellow. I know we have yellow, but I want other colors. Oh, actually, better choice. Better choice. Better choice. I have a better choice. Let's use our new code. Yeah, let's use this. This could be really cute. Oh, no. What do you want, Boone? Now's not the time. Yeah. He just sneezed on me. Are you kidding? That's disgusting. You shouldn't be going around sneezing on people. Thanks for that, Boone. Is it gonna bug me? Yes. Yes, it will. I think we'll be better off just leaving it like that and adding a bush. It looks so much better. Also, I did pick up some leaf piles. I want to pick you up and I want to stick the leaf pile in here. Where is the leaf pile? No, why not? Why not? This game can be so frustrating. There we go. That's exactly where I wanted it. To also go on the decking, I've got a patchwork chair. So let's stick that down. I was also thinking, oh, it's not going to move up, is it? I also picked up wherever it is. Oh my gosh, it's just trying to find everything in your storage. is such a pain. I got a little vintage stool, but I think what I'm going to do first is put down some code. So we've got a single flower thing, haven't we? We've got like a single flower code. There it is. And then on top of that, I'm going to stick this vintage stool. Oh, yes, I have a glass jar. It's got yarn in it. It just feels very grandma. <laughs> so that's why we have that. Let me pull this across. Pull this one over there. And then can I pull you? 
Oh my gosh, yes, yes. This is so cute. I'm happier with this. Now over in this little gap here, what I'm gonna do is I wanna add a, actually no, not that close. Maybe if we do it the second square over, I wanna add a puddle on the floor, just one, and then we're gonna stick some clotheslines down so I have customized them. It just looks like they're dripping then. It's kind of cute. Chevra thinks so. She's like, yes, I agree. I want to pull it across. Can I, Can we grab it? There we go. Pull it across and then push it. Oh, so cute. And then I'm going to add an old-fashioned wash tub. And then if Chevra... Please, Chevra. I really want to stick something where she stood. She just... Oh, she's ran over to there. Okay, that's good. <laughs> We've got a stack of clothes. Nothing says grandma call like laundry, apparently. Right, I need more flowers. <laughs> okay, so I don't know how many times I've said this before, but Nintendo, please give us sunflowers. Please give us cute little sunflowers. I'd be really grateful. I'm sure a lot of us would. Sunflowers are my favorite flower. I want them, please. All right, we just want to start doing some little bit of filling in bits. I thought it was going to go in the wrong place then. I was so worried. I was like, no, it's going to go in the wrong place, isn't it? I know it. All right, that's looking very cute. We need to put something on the floor here. Also, I have more things in my bag and I'm just like, should I just go for it? Should I just put them down? <laughs> I'm going to put the mailbox there. And then I think I want to put a mum cushion here. We got yellow because the theme on this island, I should have said at the beginning, in case this is your first time seeing this island, the color theme is pink yellow and blue that's the color theme oh my gosh he's i was gonna say he's cute but he jumped out he was like nope don't say it <laughs> i'm leaving now i do have a cherry blossom petal pile i'm gonna stick it right here very nice and then i think along here which i was gonna stick these along the beach but now nah, we're gonna stick them here instead because they're gonna look just as cute we've got log stakes I love how for the longest time I called these things log stacks. I did, it's a true story. <laughs> for the longest time I called these log stacks. And then it wasn't till, I can't remember who it was, someone told me, they're like, oh, it's it's log stakes, not stacks. Let's quickly chuck some weeds in. And then a good old pink flower, look at that. Oh my gosh, it looks so cute. We will have more leaf piles by the end of this, of course we will. But you know what? This has come out so much better than I was... I'm thinking, you know, I was worried when I knew I had to redo it because I wasn't happy with it. I was kind of a little bit worried about how I was going to do it. And I'm, I think I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, let me show you my plans quickly. So we will be bringing this river around. This will be coming around and around and probably join to like somewhere or do something. I don't know. I'm just going to take it easy. I'm going to do each section at a time, slowly, bit by bit, smaller areas because they seem to be easier for me to do and to manage yeah i'm gonna have fun with it and i'm so happy before we finish though i want to quickly change the color of our house and then we can walk around and see what we've done okay so here we are this is the new entrance for my island biscuit i am so much happier with this one like i've said a few times i really like how cutesy it feels it definitely feels like kind of cottage core whimsical fairy core esque it's Kind of, kind of, but it's definitely a grandma cat core island and we'll definitely be doing a lot more grandma things. Want to be able to mark it and stuff, but yeah, that, that's for another video. We'll talk about that later. I remade this little set of furniture items that I really liked in our original build and look at my house. I think my house came out so cute. I gave it a blue door because I feel like, you know, blue, pink, it just, it's adorable. I really like it. I like the little washing area. I like this little pathway we got. Just Everything about it makes me feel happier. And I, I, that's a good thing. That is, I hope that's a good thing. Everything about this just makes me feel happier. Like I said, I didn't hate the last one. This is what I want. This is what I envisioned. This island will be completely flat. And probably in the next video, we'll work on this area over by resident services. But yeah. I hope you all enjoyed this new entrance build that we did today. So there it is. We finished today's entrance build again. I'm not going to be changing it again because I'm happy with this one. Now, if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Come join the Jellybean family. Have the loveliest of days and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.